All right, dark stranger in the corner, uh, please state your name for the record. My name is Matt Estrada. Uh, to credential yourself, how many burgers would you say you've consumed in your lifetime? In my lifetime, 2,700. That's a decent number. Uh, which burger are you reviewing today? The Trippel Burger. All right. Uh, before we get going, do you have any unprompted thoughts or musings on this burger? Unprompted thoughts or musings? Uh, I don't know. It tasted great. Went down smooth. All right. Uh, how would you compare the taste and flavor profile of this burger to previous burgers you've eaten? Um, the apricot jam. Nice little touch at the end. Uh, I think it was like perfectly cooked, medium rare. Uh, the greens, I don't know if it was arugula, but nice little touch as well. Just kind of everything, everything complemented each other, I think. Yeah. All right. Uh, how would you describe the meat to bun to fixin ratio? Meat ratio was good. Bun ratio, ooh, a little too much. Like too much bun from here. Maybe it was the way the it just felt in my hands. I don't know. I think I agree. I think that was my major. You know what I mean? That was my biggest complaint. Also, fixings. God bless America. That was that was a ton of green. It was nice, but maybe a little without. I think I think I'm more of like the more meat and cheese, the better. You know. All right. Uh, how would you rate the cook of the burger? Perfect. Perfect medium rare. And how would you rate the structural integrity of the burger? How did it hold together? You know what? Could have been my grip towards the end, but I think throughout most of the meal, solid, solid hold. Uh, put it down, picked it up. But I do this thing where like, I kind of rip apart you know, food, maybe subconsciously, so that might have been skewed, but uh, I give it 80%. Okay. Yeah. Uh, how do you rate the mouthfeel of the burger? Mouthfeel? Oof. Uh, <laughs> 100%. All Love right. that <laughs> were there any uh, taste flavors or components that you felt were lost or underutilized in the burger? I uh, I almost wanted more apricot. Like I loved the subtleness of it, but I'm like, ah, I kind of want more. I felt like it would have gone with that whole savory sweet thing, you know. So I was looking for more. Interesting. I thought that was loud and clear. I was Ooh, okay. tasting that all over the place. But uh, how would you rate the? Uh, you feel about the vibe and aesthetic of the establishment? Oh, fucking eating with you and with Paul Patterson. So vibe, fantastic establishment, very dark, very industrial, super hipster for our for the West Side. Um, good selection of beers. All right. Yeah. What's up? Any uh, final thoughts? Final thoughts. Would you, would you recommend this place to anybody? Oh, absolutely, one hundred percent. Come here, you're gonna have a good time. Okay. Thank you very much. The darkest video ever.